we're basically starting our day. Well, I already started my day at 5 a.m. I have no classes. Well, two uh, non-needed classes. Alright guys, basically gonna start my day, other than school-wise, because I'm not gonna show you all that part. Um, I just got, our, just got out of my RTC, and I'm about to go pick up Keith and go cut all my hair off. Yeah, we're not about to get my hair cut yet. I'm about to go grab food with Keith, and then we're gonna go get my hair cut, hopefully. Maybe pick up Karen. <laughs> Alright bro, how was the food? I'm getting the itis already. You getting the itis? Heavy food. Hit a spot. I haven't even hit a spot on this. But guys, I think we just got finessed by by Italian grill. Garden. Italian garden. We have this place. We have this thing called Bobcat Bucks where we can just pay like it's pretty much a credit card. But for campus use, and oh, that's the wrong parking spot. And they were like, "Oh yeah, y'all have literally no funds on the card." And I was like, "Y'all, y'all are lying." And then, oh sheesh. And then I had to use my own payment. I had to pay for this man. And I was like, "Yo, what the flip is going on?" And then we left our food in the freaking, where did we leave it? We left it on our table. And then as soon as Keith went in, they were like, oh yeah, we, we threw it away, guys, I'm sorry. And we didn't even leave the whole entire parking lot. We were two or, two or three steps away. That, I guess finesse, I don't know. Major finesse, I don't like it. I'm upset. But the food is so fucking This may just be the last video and forever forever that my hair will be this length oh my gosh this is the most I know what I'm gonna take that off. okay so do you want to do a fade do you want it to blend down or do you want it to kind of hang over like this like why your eyebrows are here hair dries it'll shrink up Hey, you shoot a bowl cut, bro. Keith, I ever got a bowl I got a bowl cut when I was staying. I was like, who am I? <laughs> That'd be clean, bro. Straight up bowl cut the other day. It was so bad. Really? Oh, he was like, I had a bowl cut all summer. And I was like, no. What? He was cutting it off? Yes. Thank and it God. was hard because it was so thick. I don't know. Thank you. Hey, that'd be clean, I'm, sure I'm never gonna get a bowl cut. You look like freaking Bruce Lee. Because everyone's gonna talk mess about you. <laughs> That's clean, bro. Oh, snap. I don't know who you are anymore. I can see your face. <laughs> oh, shoot. You know how to... Clean. I to cut your hair off. Clean, kid. <laughs> so how are you feeling, my man? I'm feeling like a new man. Head dick. Yes. I mean, it's alright. We'll see how it goes. If RTC says no, I'm gonna be highly upset. All right, so we decided to go to a thrift shop after my haircut. I mean, this place here, Keith, what's this place called? Retro. Retro Exchange is the spot to go to. Oh my gosh, I found a yellow. Oh, I, I found a white polo jacket. Hold up. Look at this, guys. Oh my gosh, it is fresh and clean. I'm feeling myself way too much after this haircut, guys. Way too much. So many frat shirts, bro. I mean, there's gems in here without a doubt. Especially this shirt. Oh, wait, that's not a shirt. That's pants. Sorry, guys. 
like for the style now in the summer the summer now right now and the fashion right now that'd be perfect especially for like little yachty bro in a college town you could find literally every anything there's so many frat stuff like frat parties and stuff shorts for the girls jerseys for the guys and the girls war jerseys oh my gosh Keith, you look like you're in a movie just trying to find yourself. Oh, hey, we can walk. So we went to two thirds just to play around. Not really play around. I actually wanted a pop polo jacket. And then the second one, they had like a lot of jerseys. But bro, when I went in the uh, in the changing room, he just had like stickers and notes about how he would fuck up the people who uh, try and steal from him and he just did not care about his people. Alright, we while we were thrifting, we stumbled upon this spot. Bro, this is a photo shoot place, bro. Oh, damn. Okay. Oh, just kidding, guys. We found it. Bro, that's sketch. There's no door. Oh, my God. Good on there. Alright, next time we come down this place, we're gonna have a better camera and we're actually gonna do like a cinematic sequence. Cause this is just not really good. Bro, I'm, I'm, I don't know about going down the stairs. What is it? <laughs> it was just an exit. <laughs> Hello. Back to being out. Back to the as far as my arm could go. And it's still looking like y'all could only see my head. Because my sharp, sharp, sharp lens. Uh, we're about to go play tennis. Play? We're about to go practice. We're about to go to practice for tennis. And, uh... I'm on the number one team. I hope it's ranked. Uh, I'm feeling freaking so gassed up and shit. But catch y'all soon. Anyway, he is gonna have the chicken from me. I was like, that's not how you say it, bro. He like, what? I don't know. I just got enough freedom. I don't know. I just did not know. They're being so lame. Uh, we just got Chick Fil A. I'm pretty sure I'm about to end it. Chipotle. Well, I'm not about to end it. I said Chipotle. Did I say Chipotle? You said Chipotle. Chick-fil-A. I've been fucking up my words today, guys. Uh, I'm not about to end it. Somebody else is going to end it. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to Nathan's channel. And peace out, home dogs. <laughs> Such a lame intro. Keith, would you, would you agree to that? <laughs> no. That's that was a trash and enough. that was a trash one. <laughs> Guys, uh my shoe. Again. Your shoe. I hope y'all can see me. Um anyways if y'all can't see me, thanks for watching. Please drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time.